Tragic news affecting Boston Celtics star Isaiah Thomas. His sister was killed in a one-car accident early Saturday morning, according to Washington State Police. She was 22 years old. And a moment of silence here at the Garden and tears streaming down the face of Isaiah Thomas. He will play, and moments ago, he was introduced to the home crowd. Have you ever felt the emotion in NBA games that leaves you breathless or in tears? Let's explore 15 unforgettable moments in NBA history that just touched fans deeply, going beyond just competition. Number 15. Kobe Bryant Ever since the devastating loss of Kobe Bryant, his daughter Gianna, and seven others aboard that fateful helicopter, the entire world has been reeling. The loss of Kobe Bryant is hitting the LA community, the NBA community, the sports world, and in fact, people all over the world really, really hard. The impact of Kobe's passing has hit the LA community, the NBA family, the sports world, and people across the globe like a tidal wave of sorrow. The Black Mamba, the unstoppable force on the court, suddenly disappeared. It was like the air was sucked out of every basketball arena, leaving fans and players alike grappling with a reality they couldn't quite fathom. Tonight, we celebrate the kid that came here at 18 years of age, retired at 38, and became probably the best dad that we've seen over the last three years, man. So in the words of Kobe Bryant, Mamba out, but in the words of us, not forgot. Live on, brother. Number 14. John Wall. John Wall, the first pick of the 2010 NBA draft back in 2014, when Wall was rising as an NBA superstar, there was one little fan cheering him on like no other. Meet Nelson, a six-year-old Washington native in the fight of his life against cancer. Nelson didn't just see Wall as a basketball hero, he saw him as a symbol of hope, strength, and resilience. He was a source of inspiration, a reminder that even in the darkest of times, there's always a glimmer of light. Then came that unforgettable day in March 2014 when John Wall himself walked into her hospital room. Life can be so cruel sometimes. Maya became really close with John Wall, and John for the last couple of games has had Maya's name written on his shoe. And oh man, this is an emotional game for me. This is for Maya, one of my close friends that I lost that I met last year. It's just tough, man. I mean, to see a little kid that fights so hard for cancer and can't beat it. Buck, obviously John's very emotional. Guys, we'll send it back to you. Number 13, Isaiah Thomas. Isaiah Thomas, standing tall at just 5'9", was dominating the league with an impressive 29 points per game. Nothing could stop him, not even the greatest tragedy of his life. You see, Isaiah's biggest fan wasn't just any fan. It was his sister, China, who had been by his side since high school. China's sudden passing by a car accident rocked Isaiah to his core, but instead of crumbling under the weight of grief, he found solace on the court. Every bucket he made was for her. Every game played in her honor. Man, where is this coming from? It's my sister. It's her birthday today. Happy birthday. She would have been 23 today, so everything I do is for her, and she's watching over me, so that's all her. The only thing about it is once I leave this gym, I hit reality, and she's not here, so that's the... That's the tough part, but when I'm when I'm in this when I'm in this arena, I can I can lock in and, and I know everything I do is for her. Number 12, Magic Johnson. Magic steps onto the court and the crowd erupts into thunderous applause. It was a standing ovation unlike any other, a testament to the love and admiration that the fans had for him. He wasn't even supposed to be there. Just three months earlier, Magic had delivered the most gut-wrenching press conference of his career, announcing his retirement from the Lakers after testing positive for HIV. Good after late afternoon. Because of uh, the HIV virus that I have attained, uh, I will have to retire from the Lakers. He hadn't played a single second of basketball that season, yet here he was, voted into the All-Star game by fans. But not everyone was thrilled with Magic's return. Here comes Isaiah Thomas. In a moment of pure humanity, Isaiah hugged and kissed Magic on the cheek, relieving the tension and paving the way for every other player to follow suit. Maybe you'll see me back, maybe you won't, but I'll remember the, all these good times this afternoon. I'd like to thank you for sharing this with me. Thank you. Number 11, LeBron. LeBron, once hailed as the king of Cleveland, now vilified by fans who felt betrayed by his decision to take his talents to South Beach. And this fall, he's going to take his talents to South Beach, he had famously declared, sending shockwaves through the NBA and breaking the hearts of Cavs fans everywhere. And this fall, I'm going to take my talents to South Beach and um, join the Miami Heat. Fans have given their hearts to LeBron the last seven years, and now LeBron has disappointed them all. This is terrible. This is the worst thing that could ever happen to Cleveland. I hope he never wins anything in Miami. Is he is dead to me. 
for 70 years, Cavs fans had given their all to LeBron, cheering him on through thick and thin. And now, to see him turn his back on them, it was a betrayal of the highest order. This is terrible, one fan lamented. This is the worst thing that could ever happen to Cleveland. We hope he never wins anything in Miami. He is dead to us. Number 10. Michael Jordan The player LeBron always gets compared to the one and only Michael Jordan. Throughout his career, MJ experienced plenty of heartbreak and triumph, from his first retirement to iconic bus beaters over the likes of Elo and Russell. But perhaps the most emotional moment Jordan ever experienced on the basketball court was in the 1996 finals. This is my daddy. I'm very happy for him. Number 9. Willis Reed the indelible Willis Reed moment still sends shivers down the spine. In 1970, the Knicks poised on the cusp of their inaugural championship triumph. Then, calamity strikes as their talismanic player, Willis Reed, succumbs to a devastating knee injury in Game 5. And Willis is hurt as the Lakers come up with the ball. When I went down, uh, I thought I was really hurt. With Reed moved down to the sidelines, the Knicks confront a daunting challenge against the formidable Lakers, spearheaded by the legendary Wilt Chamberlain. I think we see Willis coming out. Here comes Willis. The fans are saying, everything's all right, the captain is here. <laughs> and I'm saying, boy, this is a hell of a predicament to be in. A guy on one leg, gonna play the greatest score ever. The only guy ever scored 100 points in the game. And I'm gonna try to do it on one leg. Number eight. Drezen Petrovic, the Croatian shooting guard whose brilliance illuminated the course of European basketball, tragically met his end in a car accident in 1993. Revered as one of the greatest shooters to ever poise the game, Petrovic's mark on basketball history is indelible. A moment of silence was observed for Drazen Petrovic. The Nets star was killed on Monday evening in a car accident in Germany. Number 7. Reggie Miller The most tear-jerking moment in NBA history was Reggie Miller's farewell game in 2005. After 18 incredible years with Pacers, Miller played his final game against the Pistons in the conference semifinals. Despite battling a foot injury, Miller put on a show, leading all scorers with 27 points. But it was the outpouring of love and appreciation from fans and players alike that truly stole the show. Number 6. Kevin Durant Kevin Durant, one of the biggest names in the game, facing a life-threatening injury. Now, just imagine the pressure he's under. It's not just about bouncing back, it's about defying the odds and proving the naysayers wrong. Kevin barely had time to recover from one injury before the world's already breathing down his neck, demanding he make a comeback. He's determined to defy the doubters and get back on that court. Number 5. Clay Thompson Clay Thompson, renowned as one of the Warriors' standout player, suffers a devastating blow when he tears his ACL in Game 6. The atmosphere in the arena becomes palpably tense as Clay hits the ground, the collective gasp echoing through the stands. Number 4. Paul Pierce it's like witnessing Paul Pierce's moment all over again, but this time, it's about more than just a knee injury. Paul, with 29 points under his belt, is a force to be reckoned with on the court. But then, disaster strikes. He goes down with a torn ACL, and it's a gut-wrenching sight. Against all odds, against every rational thought, Paul rises from the locker room. With a torn ACL, mind you. He steps up to the free throw line, cool as he can be, and sinks not one, but two clutch free throws for his team. Number 3. J.R. Smith We've never seen J.R. Smith quite like this before. Today is Father's Day, and there's something truly special about witnessing the usually composed J.R. Smith overcome with emotion. Can you just talk about the role that he's played in your life and what it means to you to be able to share this moment with him? I mean, my parents, my family, that's the biggest inspiration of my life. I've been, th I've been in a lot of dark spots in my life, and if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't be able to get out of it. I know a lot of people don't have their parents in their life, their mother or their father, but I just want to be like them when I grow up. I mean, everything I do is for my parents and my, my family. I mean, I don't really... Number 2. Derrick Rose Number 2 on our list brings us to the story of Derrick Rose, the youngest MVP in NBA history. But as they say, sometimes the brightest stars face the darkest storms. And for Derrick, it all came crashing down on his left foot. The crowd goes quiet as Derek falls, holding his knee in pain. It's a sight that no fan wants to see, especially not for their team's MVP. But as the reality sinks in, frustration sets in too. People were mad because he sat out the whole year. Number 1. Chris Bosh Chris Bosh's retirement from the NBA was indeed a significant moment in the league's history. The decision came in February 2019, after Bosch's health issues related to blood clots forced him to step away from the game. This marked the end of a remarkable career that saw Bosch become one of the most versatile and skilled big men in the NBA. And just one more time, what I'm going to do is scream at you. 
And I want you to scream right back at me one more time just to give some old memories. Share your thoughts in the comments. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Take care. See you next time.